Cornwall has its share of winter storms and Sennan Cove near Land's End sees most of them. How any marine animal survives at all in these is a mystery to me. But survive they do, although often animals like seals, especially young ones, do get hurt as well as undernourished through lack of food. And it's these vulnerable seals we find on our beaches when storms abate. Hi, I'm Jeff Goodman and welcome to scubaverse.com. Earlier this morning, I had a phone call from Dan Jarvis from the British Divers Marine Life Rescue. And he said there was a young seal pup that was possibly in trouble near the lifeboat station at Sandon Cove. By the time I got there, the rescue was all but over and the young seal was already bagged and yep. being weighed. Yep. My first question was why catch it rather than let it go back into the water. But Dan thought it looked underweight and so in need of some TLC. Apparently, as Dan arrived, he saw that onlookers with well-meaning yet overzealous curiosity were forcing the seal back into the water. So, unable to wait for me to arrive, he leapt into action and just caught the pup before it escaped. So far, this has been a particularly bad year for seal pups due to the very early and severe storms that have pounded our coastal waters. His name is Jeremy, which you rescue. Oh, fair and they enough. Caught, gave it From down here. Name do you want it? Oh, okay. <laughs> My name's Dan Jarvis, the Field Support Officer at British Divers Marine Life Rescue. Uh, today we've been out to rescue a seal pup here at Sennan. Uh, we had a call come through earlier this morning about a pup on the slipway next to the lifeboat station. Uh, on arrival the uh, pup was actually being approached by people, uh, unfortunately, which had caused it to start to scat down into the water. So we had to uh, quite quickly jump out and run down to the pup and catch it before it got away from us, uh, which luckily we did, as you can see, uh, as it's here with us now. Uh, on our initial assessment, it was found to have a slightly high temperature, uh, possibly due to an infection or possibly due to the stress of uh, sort of being approached and distress from uh, getting people getting too close to it. Uh, we also found that it uh, also is underweight as well. It's 15 kilos, but about six weeks old. So that's quite underweight for a pup of this age, unfortunately. So for that reason, we are gonna bring him into a rehabilitation center now. Thank you.